Hey there, Grand Island. Welcome to Viking Vision News. Glad you can join us. I'm Jamie. And I'm Dana. Today is Tuesday, October 5th, 2010. It's a day two. Here at Grand Island High School, do you have a nice homecoming weekend, Jamie? I did. The dance was fantastic Saturday night, and last week's Spirit Week was a blast. I agree. Well, we have some highlights from last Friday's pep rally later in the show, but first, the news of the day includes some important meetings. That's right, Dean. If you're interested in joining Donate Life for our already a member, please attend today's meeting immediately after school in room 217. If you cannot attend, please see Mr. Noison. Attention Viking Visions TV Club. Our next meeting is also this afternoon at 2.30 p.m. in the TV studio room 108. We'll go over some schedule changes as well as discuss featuring ideas and maybe even record a message or two. So please make every effort to attend. Those students who have not picked a date to anchor yet will want to be there for sure. Hey Dana, did you notice that as soon as October hit, the temp temperature dropped 20 degrees? I did. It's been too cold. Not ready for it. Well, you can warm up by purchasing a Viking blanket. That's right. Don't freeze, folks. Support the class of 2012. Buy your Viking blanket today. See Mrs. Castle in room 167 for your order form. It only costs $40. Don't be left out in the cold. Order yours today. In Viking Vision Sports, despite a fourth touchdown, 364 yard passing performance by quarterback Tom Jelski, it was not enough as the varsity football team dropped a hard fought battle this part Saturday, past Saturday against Williamsville East, but a score of 38 37. The Vikings look to get back on a winning track this Saturday as they take on their arch rivals, the number one ranked Sweet Home Panthers. Game time is 2 p.m. from Masters Field. Whether you're in the stands or at home, you'll be able to hear the live game on the AM radio as WGR Sports Radio 550 will be here to broadcast the contents. Good luck, Vikings. The Grand Island Central School District is proud to announce the creation of the Special Education Parent Support Network. The goal of this parent support group is to provide time for special education parents to meet and have informal discussions as well as listen to various speakers discuss a variety of topics. The Special Edition Parents Group Network Meet and Greet will be held on Monday, November 8th from 6.30 to 8.30 p.m. in the High School Senior Cafeteria. A representative from the Parent Network will give an overview of di district resources available to parents followed by a question, question and answer session. Here at Viking Visions News, we are always trying to provide you with some wisdom so that today's Viking Valley's message, take it away, Vinny. Hello, Grand Island. I'm Vinny with today's Viking Vision message of the day. Finalist Chuck Norf Chick once said, people have to really suffer before they can really work doing what they love. This means that sometimes we have to overcome struggles in our life and keep trying no matter how tough things get in order to achieve what means the most in your heart. And that's today's Viking Vision message of the day. And remember, be respectful, be responsible, and be safe. Have a great day, Grand Island. Thanks, Vinny. Okay, last Friday's pop rally was so amazing. We had great performances by the cheerleaders and the Vikingettes. Lots of fun class games and many memorable moments. So true, but probably the most two talked about moments include the unveiling of the Ark of Grand Island and the tug of war rope breaking. Let's start with the Ark. How cool was that? It was created by the classes of Mr. Cotman, Mr. Shelley, and Mr. Cahoon, and it was sick. Four of our varsity football seniors, Liam Dodd, Andrew Dale, Nick Kellner, and Ben Tompkins, carried the ark across the gym floor, followed by a cloaked Mr. Mur Mr. Murray. It got even better when the ark opened as Mr. Murray summoned the blue and white shoes, and they rose from the ark. So sweet. Then Mr. Murray did his thing, pumping up the crowd with his blue and white shoe dance. Oh yeah, but watch this game. We had four tough wars on the fourth one between the coaches versus team captains. The rope broke right in half. Everyone fell right on their backs. How crazy. So to say it was legit. No one ripped the rope. Take another look at this in slow motion. Wow. I've never seen anything like that. Best pep really ever. Well, on that note, that will wrap it up for another edition of Viking Vision News. I'm Jamie. And I'm Dana. Have a great day, Grand Island. <laughs>